Elon Musk last night made some very interesting uh, tweets, including some about Tesla's solar, solar panels. According to those tweets, Tesla's solar panels will soon only be sold in bundles with Powerwall. In other words, Tesla's solar panels and Powerwall batteries are becoming a package deal. Welcome back, dear friends. This is Armin Haryan from TorqueNews.com. If you are here first time, please take a moment, subscribe to our channel, ring the bell so you don't miss my next coverage. And if you like this video, please share it in social media and give us thumbs up like this video you will help it to put in front of more people so in recent comments on twitter last night like elon musk announced that tesla's solar roof and traditional solar panels would now be sold only as an integrated product with the power wall the company's tesla's popular residential battery system tesla would start selling the bundled residential energy products beginning next week in a bundle, in a package. In a later tweet, because Musk made several tweets, Musk mentioned that having an integrated solar and battery system should present some advantages, such as a more seamless installation process. Those are the advantages. The Powerwall battery would also just interface between the utility meter and the home's main breaker panels, providing customers with backup energy just in case power outages ensue. Here is what Elon Musk said. First, his, his first tweet was, starting next week, Tesla solar panels and solar roof will only be sold as an integrated product with Tesla Powerwall battery. And he surrounded the word with, with two asterisks. Then he also tweeted uh, saying that solar power will feed exclusively to power wall. Power wall will interface only between utility meter and house main breaker panel, enabling super simple install and seamless whole house backup during utility dropouts. So sounds like an interesting idea, right? So here's a quote. Solar power will um so that, that's what musk wrote the i was going to repeat that but i didn't want to repeat that i didn't realize it's the same i wrote twice so the tesla powerwall stands as one of the most popular residential battery systems in the market friends explains maria Murano in tesla radi saying partly it's due to the fact that it offers the least expensive storage option on a per kilowatt hour stored basis as per data from Energy Sage in its 11th semi annual solar marketplace Intel report. Considering that the demand for the battery has resulted in long wait times for Powerwall customers, Tesla's decision to sell the energy storage system with solar products makes good sense says Maria Merano. Uh, by the way, in this report, I'm going to present some other ideas from other uh, reporters uh, from in the media and whether this is a good idea, a good makes sense or no. And I would like to hear your opinion also, because there is one question I'm going to address at the end. Elon Musk's recent updates came not long after a Twitter interaction with ARK Invest Director of Research, Brett Winton, who described the current situation with his Tesla solar system. According to the analyst, his Solar Plus Powerwall setup has not generated a single watt hour since its installation back in January, simply because the utility has not approved the connection. In his response, Elon Musk noted that utility permission is typically needed when the Powerwall is full and capable of stabilizing the grid. Here's what Brett wrote and what Elon Musk responded. Brett Winton, like I said, uh, from ARK Invest said, installed by Tesla since January, hasn't generated a single watt hour, waiting for utility to approve the connection. To this, Elon Musk responded saying, did you buy a power wall? Utility permission is required for flowing electricity back to grid, but usually not if stored in our battery. This also enabled 24 seven electricity security for your home utility permission is still needed for when powerwall is full and can stabilize grid 
In other words, if you have um, solar power and you have extra energy and you want to send it to the utility, to the grid, the utility has to approve it and you have to wait. In this case, this man has been waiting since January, January, February, March, now April, finishing nearing it. four months. Okay, January, February, March, four months. And uh, But if you have power wall in your home, you, the extra energy that you will have uh, will be stored in your power wall and you can use it in your house. But if you want to still sell it to the grid to the utility uh, utility permission is still needed for when power wall is full and can stabilize grid so tesla's solar roof tiles have been the topic of several news articles as of late friends partly due to reports from customers who noted that their systems estimated uh, estimates have seen a notable price increase the price increases are significant with one customer telling Ars Technica that their solar roof code had been updated from its initial estimate of 66,000 to a far more expensive $87,000 Tesla has reneged on its solar roof contracts and has raised the prices for people like me who have already signed a contract with them, the solar roof customer noted. Tesla has not provided details about these reported price increases, though the company's online cost estimator for the solar roof now asks potential customers about their roof's complexity, which considers factors like pitch, number of joints, chimneys, and other features. Tesla also highlighted in its online cost estimator that, quote, complex roofs take more time and material to install than simple roofs. End of the quote. So I think Tesla wants to know the complexity. Um, I think the complexity of Tesla roofs uh, have caused the price increase because Tesla is worried that if the more complex the roof, the more resources they spend in order to establish the solar roof. That's why there was the um, uh, the, the, the prices. Uh, one commenter in under Tesla Rati named Plato uh, writes saying solar with battery backup that includes power conversion, grid connection, auto buyer power sales, and the ability to provide emergency home power is far more valuable than the solar tiles or battery alone. I think I tend to agree with this. The Verge writes that signs of Tesla's intention to bundle its solar products with the Powerwall were reported last month by Electric, who spotted that the company was only accepting new Powerwall orders when combined with a Tesla solar panel project. Powerwall supply shortages were thought to be to blame for the shift, with demand and wait times increasing for the home battery solution. In the fourth quarter of 2020, Tesla installed 86 megawatts of solar energy, a 59% increase compared to the same period the previous year. Alongside the change, Elon Musk announced an upcoming software update for the Powerwall, which he says will enable upward of 50% power increase depending on production date. The current Powerwall is rated to provide 5 kW of real power, 7 kW peak in North America, but in a tweet to CEO, the CEO said that Tesla's newest units can probably provide as much as 10 kW continuous and double that in peak under the right circumstances yeah personally me i'm thinking about uh, stop, uh, having a power wall a uh, power uh, solar powers power roof a solar roof on, under in my house but i think i'm going to wait a few years because new panels are becoming better and better the the changes come after tesla faced criticism of substantially raising the prices of some of its solar products earlier this month one customer another customer actually reported that the company had told them a $35,000 solar roof order would now cost them $75,000 while the price in accompanying batteries would increased from $35,000 to uh, $30,000 to $35,000. Um, my neighbor recently did a solar roof. I asked, did you do Tesla? Because, you know, a while back, Tesla's prices were very competitive. He said, no, their prices were the highest and I didn't go with Tesla. Uh, so now, um, Electric has an interesting take on this uh, bundling of this uh, power wall and solar roof as a package, saying uh, this is not a giant change, considering that Tesla already made the move to only sell power power walls through its solar installation last month like i just said as for people ordering solar with power wall uh, 
Fred Lambert of Electrex says, I am sure it was a decent chunk of Tesla's solar orders considering the cost of a Powerwall, but I wouldn't be surprised if it's around half of even the minority of the projects. Powerwall integration actually was one of the advantages of buying Tesla Solar, but the company also partnered with other solar installers to add Powerwall to their offerings. I'd rather Elon address the solar roof price controversy, especially going back on contracts that were already signed, said Lambert, but I guess that's not happening. What do you think of this latest move from Tesla friends? Let us know in the comment section below. This is Armin Harayan from TorqueNews.com. If you are here first time, please take a moment subscribe to our channel for daily tesla news ring the bell so you don't miss my next tesla coverage and i'll see you soon in our next report i would appreciate if you would share this in social media twitter facebook and others and also uh, please like this video if it's informative have a great day see you soon